forth, back forth, and then what's open? Over the top to opposite. Kelly Dunn is where she wants to be, at Nazareth College, coaching the women's basketball team. It was a dream come true. And to be able to coach at your alma mater, I think, is every coach's dream. As a player, Kelly was a four-year starter, two-time captain, and all Empire 8 as a senior. Nazareth is a special place for the entire Dunn family. In fact, most game nights are like a family reunion at Kadera Gym. Spread, spread, spread. Kelly's brother Tim is her volunteer assistant. Straight up. In the crowd are parents Eileen and John, along with two brothers, Greg and Rich. The Dunn-Naz connection started when coach Mike Daly, who recently passed away, recruited Greg to play on the men's team in the mid-1990s. I've been coming to Nazareth since I was a little girl. Um, I think I was in the first grade when my oldest brother Greg came here and played here. Um, so I grew up coming to all of his games. Coach Daly is the reason why we're such a Nazareth family. And we knew that Greg would have a great experience because of the tight-knit family culture under Coach Daly's leadership. Greg Dunn was an All-American for the Golden Flyers. He's in the Nazareth Hall of Fame and is now head coach at Brockport. Tim was going to follow Greg and was set to join the Golden Flyers in 1997. But a pool accident near their home in Northport, Long Island suddenly changed his life. I ran to the end of my friend's pool. I dove in to uh, the shallow end on the slope of the shallow end meets the deep end. And unfortunately, on a dive that I probably have done hundreds of times as a kid, having a pool in my own backyard, I hit my head on the bottom and I knew immediately that something was wrong. I was on the bottom of the pool for several minutes and luckily my friends realized something was wrong and they came and they pulled me out. They saved my life, they performed CPR on me. I immediately was entered into ICU where I spent uh, about a week and a half and that's when you know, I was told about my condition that I most likely would probably never walk again. Tim, a C4, C5 quadriplegic, required extensive and costly care. The Northport and Greater New York community held fundraisers. Among those helping, Adam Graves from the NHL's New York Rangers, and Jeff Van Gundy, the Nazareth grad, and at the time, head coach of the NBA's New York Knicks. Jeff Van Gundy was actually one of the first people to call my parents um, in the hospital after I got injured. Mike Daly immediately picked up the phone and told Jeff what had happened. And Jeff called my parents when I was in ICU, said, you know, anything I could do to help, just let me know. He gave my parents his, uh, his cell number. About a year later, after I got out of the hospital, he came to Norfolk High School where there was a basketball fundraiser for me. And he came and he spoke to the crowd and, you know, he stayed for a couple hours signing autographs. He just was, is a tremendous guy. I'm blessed that I have, first and foremost, the best family, the best parents, tremendous siblings that are there for me 365 days a year for these past 21 years since I was injured. Tim ended up going to Hofstra because of its proximity to the Dunn family home. Today, they all live in the Rochester area. Rich Dunn, who went to Notre Dame, is an oncologist at Strong Memorial. Eileen and John live in Fairport with Tim. And now, two decades after the accident, Tim is on the court at Naz as an assistant coach for his younger sister. Even though I could no longer play the game, I still wanted to be around the game. I still love the game. So going from watching Kelly and Greg play at Nazareth all those years, I never really imagined that I'd be as an assistant coach here someday, helping my sister out. He is my X's and O's guy. The girls absolutely love him. They respect him. They trust him. Um, they value his opinion. Um, I think he comes into practice day in and day out and games with fresh ideas. I'm just there to help her in any way I can to bring that same type of family culture and atmosphere that made our family fall in lo love with Nazareth 20 plus years ago.